Yo, 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 what's going on with y'all, man? We're back with another video. I hope y'all all having a blessed day. I hope y'all feeling good, living good, all that good shit, man. I'll come back at y'all with another one. Today, I wanted to talk a little bit about school, why school is bullshit, why school is a bunch of a waste of time, why school is a programming facility, different things. We're going to talk about all that, why I dropped out, all that shit. We're going to talk about all that in today's video. Um, we're going to talk about school. I want y'all to comment what grade y'all in though in this video. What grade are y'all in? Are y'all in high school, college, middle school, whatever? Comment down below what grade y'all in. And also comment, um, do you like school? Are you enjoying it? Comment all that shit down below, man. We're going to get into it. Um, so why I dropped out of high school? Um, this year was supposed to be my 12th grade year. I was supposed to graduate this year. Realistically, I was supposed to graduate last year, but I got held back. So um yeah things was a little bit slow for me but i was supposed to graduate this year man and i was actually super close to graduating but what happened was um when when the whole pandemic and shit happened y'all know how like they they forced us to do like online school and different shit like that um that kind of slowed me up you know what i mean because like i told y'all with that online school shit nobody was focusing on that shit let's be honest like when they told us we got to do online school how many of y'all was really focusing and really like doing that online work Let's be honest, like niggas is not focusing on that shit. Niggas is not waking up early to go on no computer and look at that damn teacher on the computer. Like niggas is not trying to do that. And if they is doing it, they're not really taking it serious as if they was to be in class. You feel what I'm saying? So that kind of slowed me up. But one of the things that was really like the biggest thing for me and why I wanted to stop school is it was holding me back from chasing my dreams, bro. Um, Once I was like, once I hit 11th grade, ninth grade year was cool. 10th grade year was cool. But once I hit like 11th grade and I started focusing on different things that I really wanted to pursue and do like music and, and I found YouTube around this time and um, I was like focusing on my clothing brand, the Up Next brand. I was doing a lot of stuff, you know, uh, when I was in 11th grade. That's when I finally started to, you know, start different things that I wanted to start. Um, and once I started starting it and I started making like some money from it and different things like that, like school was holding me back, bro. We in school for six, seven hours a day, right? Throughout that whole day of us being in school, we could be getting money. We can be learning things about our business, different things like that. But we instead, we in school being programmed, all this bullshit. Um, and then school, not only does school progr program you to bullshit, school will really stress you the fuck out. School will take your energy. You got to study for this test for this teacher. You got to study for this test for that teacher. You know what I mean? If you fail the test, you got to do it over. And, and it's, you got to focus on getting credits and all this dumb shit. School for me, bro, I always hated school, so I ain't got nothing nice to say about school. But uh, once I hit this this certain level, man, I'm like, man, like I'm getting money now. You know, my, I'm, I'm starting my own shit now. Like this shit is holding me back from doing what I want to do. Like, and I'm telling you a lot to you not. Soon as the, soon as the pandemic started and they shut down schools and I had to do school at home, literally my whole entire life changed. The pandemic did a lot of bad things to a, to a lot of people. The pandemic was the worst thing that ever happened to some people. For me, the pandemic was the best thing that ever happened. Like, I gained a lot of money. I, I, I learned to love myself a lot more because I was forced to be in the house. I was on quarantine. I was forced to be inside to learn myself, love myself more and stuff like that. Um, I was focused on my YouTube. I was making tons of music. I was focused on my clothing line. Like, I had money coming from a whole bunch of different directions. Like, I was just on my shit. You feel what I'm saying? Um, and that, and I was, the, that was because I was out of school. I had all the time in the world to just focus, focus, focus on what I wanted to do. You feel what I'm saying? And around that time I hit a hundred thousand subscribers. If it wasn't for this pandemic, I wouldn't be at a hundred thousand subscribers. I probably would have, but it would have took me so much more time to get it. It's like, soon as we was out of school, I gained and I did everything I wanted to do. School was holding me back from a lot of stuff. And one of the things that parents don't realize and understand is like when you go to your parents and you tell them you want to drop out and all that, they're going to look at you crazy as fuck. Like, what? You want to drop out? Like, dude, do you not know if you drop out of high school, your whole life is going to change? You're not going to be shit? That's how parents look at you. You know, they make it seem like school is the only way out. They make it, school, they make it seem like school is the, the, the end all be all. If you don't finish school, you ain't going to be shit. If you don't finish school, you're not going to get a job. If you don't finish school, you ain't going to be nothing. You know, I made that choice for myself because at the end of the day, I know realistically school doesn't do anything. It doesn't teach us what we really need to be taught. And it's, it's, it's bullshit. All school teaches you to do is be a slave and work for somebody else. All school teaches you to do is how to fulfill somebody else's dream. School don't teach you how to become your own boss. 
School don't teach you how to invest. School don't teach you how to manage money. School don't teach you about mental health. It's kids out here that stress the fuck out, that's dealing with trauma, dealing with suicidal thoughts, different things like that. Do y'all think they got classes for mental health? And I know some schools out there actually got these things, but realistically, all around the world, public schools don't got this type of shit. If you send your kid to a public school, nine times out of 10, he's going to get programmed bullshit. And if you want to send your kid to a school that got this level of teaching, you got to pay thousands of dollars for it. So either way, we screwed. And on top of that, this is just going to put the ice on top of the iceberg. You have to send your kid to school. You know, let's just say you're a person out there that's like, man, I want to teach my own kid. I don't want to put my, my kid in the system. I want to teach him his own shit. You can't. Because uh, according, according to the law, if you don't send your kid to school, guess what? You get sent to court and you go to jail. So I'm telling y'all, man, school is a bunch of programming, man. They, they, they program your kid to be a slave. They program your kid to be a worker. You know what I mean? Like, I always wonder, like, when I was in school and we had these little sessions where our teachers always asked us, what do you want to be when you grow up? I used to always raise my hand and tell her a boss. You know, I used to tell my teacher I wanted to be a boss. I want to be a rapper. I want to be a boss, an entrepreneur, this, this, and that. They look at you crazy as fuck when you say that. Like, you want to be a boss. You want to be a worker. Like, huh? Like, teachers really don't be believing in you. And it's not even just teachers not being able to believe in you. It's more so like a lot of people, y'all got to understand, a lot of people can't see past having they, like a dream. Like, a lot of people feel like a dream is just something out of a movie. Like, a lot of people can't see that. Like, a lot of people only see go to school, get a job, and work, and become retired at 60. Like, that's most people's life. That's most people's dream. You feel what I'm saying? People don't understand. Like, we live in a new era. Like, you can be successful today no matter what age you are. 15, 14, 16. People done done it. The proof is in the pudding. Parents don't see that, though. Because they was programmed to look, we got to go and get a job. And if we don't get a job, we ain't going to be shit. That's what parents is programmed to. They was programmed to working. They was programmed to going to school. And that was their only way out. We live in a whole new era. And parents and, and other people just don't understand that. You know what I mean? So for everybody that's out there watching, man, if it's a dream that you want to do and you feel like school is in a way of that and you old enough to drop out, Hey, do what you do. Don't feel like a failure for dropping out. Don't feel like you ain't shit for dropping out. I'm not encouraging nobody to drop out. If you in school and you doing good, stay in school, do what you got to do. You know, I, I might even go back and get my diploma at some point. Who knows? But right now and, and where I'm at in my life right now, I don't plan on it. You know what I'm saying? You know, my mom want me to go back and get it so bad. She, oh, no, 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 You know how parents be, man. They always want you to graduate and do do great things. But I be having to tell my mom, man, this is it's nothing. It's bullshit, man. You know, when is people going to wake up and understand school is nothing but a programming facility? It's to program your mind, corrupt your mind. You know what I'm saying? Everything you getting taught in there, you're not even going to remember by the time you graduate. I'm telling y'all, it's bullshit. You in there with a bunch of different energies. Nobody in there matches your vibes. When I was in school, I felt like I was just a loner. I didn't relate to nobody in this motherfucker. We in class learning about a bunch of bullshit. They all excited to learn about the new lesson. Oh, we're doing this. And I'm just in the back of the class like, oh, here the fuck we go again. You feel what I'm saying? I didn't relate to nobody in my school. I looked at everybody like zombies. I'm like, damn, I'm really in here with a bunch of zombies. You feel what I'm saying? Because at the time of me, like, being in school, the last time I was really in school is when, like, before this whole pandemic happened. I ain't been in school since. You feel what I'm saying? So when I was in there, I was just like, man, what the hell? Like, I'm in here with a bunch of zombies. Everybody doing weird shit. Everybody eating that program, nasty-ass food that's in the school. You feel what I'm saying? Like, I'm telling y'all, bro. I know y'all feel the same way. I know I ain't the only one that feel like this. I know y'all niggas be going to school every day, and y'all be like, damn, I can't relate to these people. You in there with a bunch of people that's programmed, a bunch of botted out ass people. So it was like, I was in my mind like, man, I'm wasting my time coming here every day, man. I'm wasting my time. But then by the time I get home, I'm stressed out because I got to do a test tomorrow. And I ain't got time for that shit, bro. I'm trying to focus on my dreams. Every day I wake up, the only thing that I want on my mind is my dreams and my goals. Not school. Not Mrs. Sassy's assignment. All that nut ass shit, man. Fuck school, man. Y'all like, comment, share, subscribe. Y'all let me know y'all thoughts on school. Let me know how y'all feel about this shit. But all throughout my life, I, I felt like this, man. Even when I was younger, I remember my first time going to school. I was in preschool. I cried. That shit show you right there. This shit is bullshit. School is really a programming place, man. I cried. 
You know what I'm saying? Because I didn't want to go there. I ain't know them folks. You feel what I'm saying? Y'all let me know y'all thoughts and opinions on school. Let me know how y'all feel about it. But I'm telling y'all, man, school was designed to brainwash us as people. You know, like you just got to do your research and learn this and understand this. School is designed to program you. Why do you think they make it a law to send your kid to school? Why do you think it's a crime if you don't send your kid to school? Your mom can go to jail if you're tardy. You have to be in school. You have to be in school. Just think of this, bro. This is your mom. She had you. You came out of your mom's stomach, which means this is her child. She, by law, has to send you to school because the white man said so. Just let that sink in for a minute. Pit two and two together. Jail is just like prison. You in a uniform. You go to lunch at a certain time. You got to raise your hand to go to the restroom. You getting taught bullshit. You feel what I'm saying? Like, I'm telling y'all, just wake up and realize this, man. They teaching us fake history. Half the history they teach us in school don't be real history. Y'all do understand this and know this. They teach us fake history. Um, Half the shit they teach you when it comes to this is, is the complete opposite. I'm telling y'all, bro. All that math, mad act shit, we don't even be need to know all that. X, Y, Z times 10 plus 2, 3, 4, 5, X, 2 to the nearest 10th place to the power of 3rd to the nine. 2 plus 9x times 2.3 equals pi. 6, 7, 8 plus 3 equals y equals 12. Why the fuck we got to do all this work just to get to one number? All this work. We got to do all this work just to get to one number? You think we in our personal life, when we graduate, we're going to really be in a grocery store buying groceries and doing that math in our head? 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 8, 9, 9, okay, so shit. I'm not finna be doing that stupid ass shit, man. Are you crazy? I'm telling y'all, man, this school shit is BS, bro. Wake up and realize we as people is being programmed, okay? We being programmed. We is. They teaching our kids this. This is why they want your kid to go to school young. They got to corrupt their mind at a young age. You feel what I'm saying? That's why preschool is a thing. Kindergarten, first grade, second grade, third grade. This is why these things are a thing. You feel what I'm saying? I'm telling y'all, man, just wake up, stay woke, and understand that this shit is, is it's, this is the system. This is how it's, it's designed to be this way. It's designed to corrupt these, these kids' minds. You know what I'm saying? And then they make you feel like less than because you, you got a bigger dream than other kids that's in the class. Other kids want to be a fighter, fighter, a policeman, different things like that. You tell your teacher you want to be a boss. They look at you like you crazy. Like you just said, a fish can fly. Hey, y'all let me know y'all thoughts and opinions. Like, comment, share, subscribe if you're new. Let me know how y'all feel about school in the comments. Me personally, this is my thoughts and opinions on school. And when it's time for me to have a kid, I'm going to be teaching my kid. I want to be hands-on with my kid. I want to teach my kid real shit. You know what I mean? I want to teach my kid about health. I want to teach my kid how to heal himself when he's sick. I want to teach my kid, you know, real things. How to how to how to how to manage your money, how to manage mental health. You know, I want to put my kid on on self-improvement books, different things like that. Y'all got to start asking yourself, why don't school teach people these things? It's a reason they don't teach people these things. They got a real tight curriculum and they stand by that curriculum to program kids minds so kids don't be shit, so kids can be a worker. How the hell are we gonna be learn how to how to how are we gonna learn how to become a boss when we being taught by a bunch of workers? You gotta think about that for a second. I love y'all. Like, comment, share, subscribe. This is just my thoughts and opinions. You ain't gotta follow, but this is just how I feel. I love y'all. I'm out.